What is going on, guys? Got Clutch cheer, and today I'm back with Medal of Honor Warfighter. Uh, I just picked up this game yesterday when it was released, uh, and I really haven't played too much of it, as really a lot less than I was hoping I'd play, because I really wanted to make a kind of an in-depth review by this point. But I only have like three hours played because I don't have much time to play during the week, and uh, yeah, that's that's really the only reason. Uh, but I did make a video yesterday for vid through a first look, so I'll leave the link to that in the description if you want to go check that out. It's on YouTube, uh, on their channel. And uh, I only had like two hours of game like gameplay experience when I made that, so it really was a first look. It, I didn't really know much, so I'm gonna kind of add on to what I said in that video in this one. So if you want to go check that one out first, go go right ahead. But I'll probably say everything that that I said in that video in this one again. Uh, but really quickly, this gameplay isn't that great, and uh, I know it's not, and I'm not trying to make excuses that I'm like, oh, this is just my my bad game. I have so many better ones, but yeah, no. A lot of them are like this, but this is really, this is like my best one on this map, and I had better ones on the other maps, like the one that the beta was on, and the one I uploaded on my, on the one I, the gameplay I had on my video for vid through. It was that map, if, if you don't know what map I'm talking about. Um, I have a bunch of decent gameplays on, on that one. I didn't record them, though, because I, I didn't feel like recording at the beginning of my session when I just sat down and played today, because I'm like, oh, well, probably my first few games aren't going to be that great, and turns out they were, and the ones I started recording weren't that great. So, yeah, it's, it's, it's all right. I mean, I kind of sped through some of the slower parts and uh, all that. Uh, but let me talk about what I think about the game because I bet you guys want to know. I actually have two things to uh, talk about. I'll quickly talk about what I think, and then uh, I'll talk about my other thing. Um, so far, I think this game's pretty good. It's pretty fun. Uh, it's kind of aggravating at some points because it does seem like when you get hit, it's almost Im well. I wouldn't say almost impossible, but when you when you get to hit, when you get hit, it's super hard to kill the enemy because like your screen just shakes so violently and your screen turns all red and like greenish like it is right now and your health thing goes down to like single digits and you're like oh i don't want to go out there and get hit anymore because then my health thing will go all the way down and i i don't really like having a an actual number telling you what your health is because to me that just makes it more aggravating uh, especially when you're shooting at someone and then you see that they only have like 4% health and they killed you. Uh, so that that annoys me a little bit. But overall, I think this game is better than the Medal of Honor from two years ago when the year Black Ops came out, 2010. Um, that game, the engine was a lot less smooth and I didn't really like that too much. Uh, this game, it does seem like the engine's better because it is the, I think, I'm pretty sure it's the engine from Battlefield 3, the DICE 2 engine. I believe, uh, but it is a lot smoother, it definitely doesn't feel as laggy and, and stuff, but there is times when I'm, I feel like I die really quickly, like in Modern Warfare 3, but maybe, maybe I'm, I'm dying at a normal rate, I guess, and Modern Warfare 3 just made me feel like I'm dying too quick or something, uh, but I don't know, I also had really bad lag spikes at the beginning of, uh, a game earlier in my session that I played today that I wasn't recording, but they were pretty bad, so I don't know what it was, because it definitely wasn't Fraps, it was the game, so uh, that those are some problems. Uh, but one thing that I think is pretty cool, but also at the same time uh, very deadly, uh, both to the enemy and to you, is uh, right here, that uh, little bit of uh, whatever, I don't even know what it is, like signal something, signal scan, I think that's what it says, I could barely read in this little preview box. Uh, but it's like a, all these things that when you press C on the PC, it's like a special ability. So on the like assault class, you'll have a grenade launcher, let's say, and you press C and you'll be able to use your grenade launcher. On here, you press C and you kind of scan through the the map and you see for like a few seconds where the enemy is. So that that's pretty cool. I like that. But at the same time, I feel like if you're trying to ambush someone you know that they're coming around the corner and they use that they'll know where you are and they'll just destroy you which sometimes it's really annoying but it's very helpful so that's why i like this class It's probably 
well, I don't know if probably, but it might turn out to be the newbiest class in the game, and everyone's going to hate it. Uh, but for right now, I, I take pride in this class, and I like it. So I'm going to continue to use it. Uh, but sniping, uh, really quickly, sniping's pretty annoying, too, at first. Uh, because the, the the first sniper rifles that you get are, are really bad, and you get hit markers on upper body shots, which isn't fun. So I don't like that. But like I said, overall, it's a pretty good game. Uh, in my... Oh yeah, really quickly, uh, one last thing. There's the buddy system. So you have one person in your fire team who's your buddy. And you could go and you could heal with him, and you could get all your health back really quickly, and more ammo which is very helpful, uh, especially if you're like pinned down and you ran out of grenades, let's say, you kind of resupply. I don't even know if it resupplies grenades. I'm assuming, but I don't know. Um, yeah, so the buddy system, it can be very effective if you're playing with someone that you know. I don't have any friends that have this game, so I haven't been playing with anyone I know, so I, don't, I can't really tell, but I could definitely assume that it'll, it's pretty effective if you're playing with friends. Uh, so, I would get this game if you have the money for it, but if you're trying to decide on this game or any other game that's coming out this year, I'd probably get something else because uh, I don't I don't feel like this game is going to have that big of a lifespan once Halo 4 and Black Ops 2 comes out. It's kind of, it's going to be dead like the older Medal of Honor is right now. So, that's my opinions on that. But really quickly, I might have to add some more gameplay, maybe some sniper gameplay, which I fail. I don't even get a kill. Um... Which I'll probably do at the end of this. Um, yeah, uh, what was I going to say? Uh, oh yeah, a walkthrough of the campaign. Uh, I was going to do a whole walkthrough of this campaign, but I kind of, I'm thinking of not doing it because of uh, the fact that if I was going to do a walkthrough of the campaign, I'd want to get it done at like midnight uh, the day the game comes out because then that'll be a lot better and a lot more people will want to look up stuff for that and really the views is what makes me want to continue to uh, make a series because if it starts to get like zero views and no one watches I'm like oh well why am I recording stuff and working on editing videos together if no one's going to watch them so I'm just kind of thinking that no one's really going to watch a walkthrough and I, I kind of want to just play this game by myself and just kind of enjoy it and maybe upload parts of it I don't know with the post commentary so let me know what you guys think if you really want to see a campaign walkthrough then let me know and I'll, I'll do it but it's kind of have to be kind of like a really overwhelming majority of you guys that want to see it for me to actually do it because I just don't really feel like it and I have so many series that are going on right now that I don't want to add any more to my list because I can't even get the ones that I'm doing right now done. So, yeah. You guys will see some more multiplayer, though, so you don't have to worry about not seeing this game at all. But until, like, Halo 4, you'll probably have a lot of this because I, I've been playing... Well, I've only been playing for, like, three hours over, overall, but I, I'm thinking this weekend, once I have more time, I'll be playing a lot and recording a lot, so... Stay tuned for that, but otherwise, rate the video. Again, I'm sorry for the not-so-great gameplay, but who really cares? As long as, you could, as long as you could see what the game's like and, uh, I don't know, maybe you appreciate my opinion on the game and you'll go out and buy it or something. I don't know. If you do, let me know, and I'll contact EA to give me some money for advertising their game. Uh, but anyway, that's pretty much it. Hope you guys enjoyed. Until next time, I'll see you all later. Goodbye.